This is the top 10 racist Fortnite skins. Number 10, Battlehound. Epic Games tried to pay tribute to the mythological creature, the Centaur, but that idea fell flat on its head when this design was released. This completely offends the furry community by showing that all furries look like this, which they don't. Number 9, Black Knight. Why's it gotta be black though? Number 8, Crack Shot. Just because the skin is a nutcracker does not mean it has to look like a cracker. Diversity is key. Also, the facial expression shows that the skin does crack. Um, not all crackheads look like this. Number 7, Cuddle Team Leader. In relation to the Battlehound, the Cuddle Team Leader is the most popular furry related skin to date, which is not good at all. There needs to be more furry related skins in this game, just one and a half skins is not enough. Come on, Epic Games. Number 6, The Raptor. This skin is racist because it touches on a style from World War II. It has the Russian balaclava, racist, European flight jacket, racist, and the American trench shovel, racist. This skin is cluttered with bigotry. Number 5, Red Knight. Why's it gotta be red though? Number 4, the Rex. The dinosaurs did not die for this racism. The guy literally skinned a dino species just for clothing. How could you be more racist? Makes me sick just thinking about it. Number 3, the Wukong. Upon first glance, this looks pretty cultured. A samurai warrior is a very valued soldier in Asian areas, but if you see the face, you can tell it's a monkey! First, the furries are going apeshit over this. Second, apes are not even in Asia. Apes reside in American countries. I'm offended. Trigger warning may cause anger. Number two, Funk Ops. Not all dark skinned people are DJs. Come on, this is offensive to all African Americans from the 80s. And number one, our number one spot goes to Ginger Gunner. I know what you're thinking. How could this be racist? It's food. But as you look closer to the skin, you notice a swastika patch on his skin's arm. But that's not the worst part. If you look at the facial expression, you can tell this skin is proud of the Nazi fandom. I am literally calling the police on this skin.